FSC is the Forest Stewardship Council. It is a worldwide certification for wood and wood products and basically the idea is to uh, certify the management of forests around the world and to ensure that when people are buying wood and wood products in retail stores or from suppliers they will have a guarantee that the wood and wood products they buy are coming from sustainably managed forests. I think it became obvious in the early 90s uh, that uh, certification was necessary for wood and wood products because there were many, many claims being made around the world about the sustainability of wood products. We looked into those claims and we found that 99.9% uh, .9 of them had absolutely no validity at all, so it became very clear that there was a need for a proper certification system that would guarantee to the public that if they saw a particular logo on a product, they need not any longer worry about where it came from because it would be coming from a well-managed forest. The idea was to get retailers in the UK and suppliers of timber and so on to join with us uh, to work towards getting all their products certified by the end of 1995. Of course, a tall order. This was in 1990. We had five years to do it in. Uh, in the first year of campaigning for this, um, we had many, many chief executives of many, many companies tell us that this wasn't their business, they weren't particularly interested, they didn't think the environment was a real concern for them. So getting businesses to take this seriously and getting businesses to understand that there was a reputational risk involved uh, in, in basically not reacting positively to the disappearing forests around the world was quite hard. We had a lot of um, chief executives that we contacted early on who basically told us to go away sometimes in less polite uh, words than others. It all changed on September the 3rd when we got a telephone call from uh, Alan Knight of, of B&Q, working for B&Q at the time as their environment advisor, saying that B&Q was interested in working uh, with us to try and find ways of ensuring that the products they were selling were coming from well-managed forests. Once we had one company on board and we could go out to the media and say, look, we, we've got a, a big retailer working with us on this. Very quickly, we reached our target of 10 companies working with us by the end of the year and surpassed it. And that then grew into what today is the Global Forest and Trade Network. Up until then, really, WWF and most conservation organisations that were you know, working on projects in the field in particular, were focused on uh, the preservation side of conservation. This was different because this was beginning to look at management and how management was impacting on, on uh, forests around the world. It was also different in so far as up until then most NGOs had seen the private sector business as the enemy rather than as a potential collaborator. And so this was really the, a, a bit of a turning point where we began to see that we could actually work with industry, work with the private sector to try and develop a common agenda and have, if you like, a win-win for both. More and more certification is recognised as a way for um, businesses to actually be able to put their hand on their heart and say, look, the products we're selling you, the consumers, uh, are products that are coming from well-managed forests. It has to be also said that you know, consumers are more and more conscious of the fact that uh, business has an impact on the environment, that their consumption uh, patterns have a, an impact on the environment and that they can in fact play their role in trying to make the right choices. When I walk around supermarkets and, and other places and see the FSC logo, the tick tree as we used to call it, I'm delighted because it shows that the, the whole um, system has caught on and that people take it seriously and that increasingly consumers are demanding these products, therefore retailers are supplying those products. So yes, very encouraging. <laughs>